about uh, feature for our application so for this uh, in network just jump to log out to the index.js file and uh, what i need to do i need to import the firebase here from my config and uh, i'm gonna just uh, simply write logout uh, user and this should be an arrow function it will not uh, take any parameter to call i'm going to just create a try catch block and if any error occur it will simply return error and uh, for try block i'm i'm going to use uh, return and this should be an async function here i'm going to use uh, await uh, firebase dot uh, auth dot sign out so that's all for this function i need to export it uh, default uh, logout user and uh, move to our index.js file here i need to import uh, logout user from uh, uh, logout file now export it here as well so logout user that's all now jump to our dashboard till um, I'm going to log in our user test it with uh, gmail.com and write your password one two three four five six now for the dashboard I'm gonna create a logout uh, function here let's uh, give it a name logout and uh, const uh, logout this should be an arrow function here as well and then simply uh, bring logout user from your network so logout user bring this from the network and uh, dot uh, then I'm going to clear my async storage if uh, it's gonna mm, execute successfully else uh, if uh, there's some error occur then I can I gonna simply going to alert that error wow, what is uh, wrong here so inside then I'm going to clear my async storage so clear async storage the method I had already created in my async storage file to clear all of the uh, storage when I gonna execute this it will gonna uh, clear all of uh, the stored uh, async storage and uh, if any error occur then uh, I'm I'm gonna do the same thing what I'm doing here so uh, then if it executes successfully I'm going to navigate navigate navigation dot uh, replace to my dashboard screen it's gonna jump to our dashboard screen here I'm sorry this is a dashboard screen I have to uh, jump on login screen so now uh, like we have our logout button it will show you a pop-up and when you click on yes button I have to pass my function of uh, logout here just call your function here so uh, let's click on this if you press on no then it will uh, do nothing and if you press yes you can see user had been logged out and if you uh, reload your application you can see uh, now we have any async stories so it is not redirecting to user dashboard screen so that's all for this video from next video will start working with our dashboard screen.